Is it too late to start revising is a question that lots of people ask and with less than two months until exam season, to put it bluntly, the short answer is yes, it is a bit late. However, I'm going to share with you today on why you can definitely still pull up your grades if you do revise now. And while now might be a bit of a late time to start, it is definitely still worthwhile to get those extra bits of revision in before the exams. Now, the short answer is assuming a lot of things. It assumes that you want to go for the top grades or that you want to make the biggest improvements and that you haven't started revising or you haven't done anything before. Now, for lots of you, you would have done revision in class. You would have done things outside of school. Perhaps some of you also do intervention as well, and that all counts towards revision. Now, in the majority of cases, a a month and a half is quite a short amount of time to revise everything you need to know in your GCSE course. So by now, if everything went to plan, you should probably be doing past papers, if not just going over things like exam technique or finishing up and touching up on some of the content with us from Anki or Seneca. You should be very solid on the content, if not on past papers already. Now I'm not going to lie, but this point is quite hard to catch up because you've essentially lost a month of revision, which was really important in order to actually go ahead and do past papers and things like that, which are crucial when it comes to doing the exams. The best thing you need to do is smash out lots and lots and lots of revision. Now it's a careful balance because if you do too much you'll burn out, if you do too little then you're not going to achieve what you want to. Now if you want to go from a grade 5 to a grade 9, you've got to think, you've got a month and a half, realistically you didn't put in the work when you needed to so you're now in this position where you might be working at grade 5 and you've just got to accept that you're not perhaps going to be able to reach those top top grades that you'd hoped for and it comes down to taking responsibility for not starting revision earlier but I mean that's not the end of the world you can definitely pull up your grades a significant amount in a month and a half people can go from grade fives to grade sevens even grade eights a push three grades isn't unheard of for an improvement but if you really really do try between now and the exams you could see improvements of probably about one grade if not two grades if you're if you're working hard At the moment the best thing you can do if you have not started revising is to bang out things like Anki Senate but when I say you've really got to go for it and do it, you need to learn as much content as you can because there's no point in sitting past papers if you don't know the content well enough. If you've got a slight gist of what the content's about, then you could probably get away with it and just learn through doing past papers and lots of repetition. I've spoken about this before in just all my other tips and tricks on how to revise the subjects, but you've really got to bang this out and you've got to do lots of it. Now, even if that means that two weeks before your exams, you're still doing this sort of knowledge, that's fine because in those last two weeks you'll have to bang out loads and loads of practice papers and again that's where the exam technique comes in now obviously it's not ideal this whole situation isn't ideal if you're just starting revising now but you've got to make the best of a bad situation here and the best way you can do that is just to start if you've been following some semi-consistent revision schedule then you should actually be all right as long as you get to grips with the content and the base and everything you should be fine i mean the main thing you have to do in the first month and a half or so is to get a solid understanding on the content and if you already have that solid understanding then you're fine you're up to par again this isn't me saying don't bother revising because you've missed the boat or anything like that. Do start revising because you can definitely pull up your grades quite a lot but again now at this point it's about toning down expectations if you had very high expectations for going for those top grades. If you lower your expectations a bit and just set a realistic goal then it means that you won't be disappointed with any grades you get back at school or any like topic papers. Just set something that's reasonable and realistic and reflects what you think you can achieve before the actual exams. So all in all it's a very short video but it's a question that lots of people asked and I just wanted to address it quickly because the sooner I can the sooner you guys can get out there and start revising or keep doing what you're doing if you did find this video useful please drop a like subscribe comment videos come out every Sunday at four o'clock if you have any specific video ideas that you want me to do leave them in the comments below and I'll try and get through to doing them all my discord server is also in the description so if you want any tailored or specific advice you can message me on discord or you can shoot me a message on Instagram so thank you very much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video